Hello everyone, welcome to Beauty in the Garden. I'm T. So in today's video, we're planting up our spinach. Now I was gonna go ahead and do it another day, but I'm gonna do it today because I have so much more to plant. So right here is the window boxes that I was telling you guys about that I'm gonna be planting the spinach in. But I have one problem with this soil. I need the soil to have a great deal of drainage. So what I'm gonna do is let's go ahead and get this video started. I'm gonna go ahead and toss the soil. Um, let's see if you can see, this soil is really wet. So we need to make sure this soil is getting proper drainage. Okay, so what I'm gonna be adding into this soil is some perlite. Not much, not much perlite, but just enough to make sure that I have drainage. Now make sure that you stay, this is away from your face because it does have a lot of dust and it can blow. So we was gonna try to make sure that we face it away from us. And I'm just gonna sprinkle a little bit of perlite into this window box. Give it a nice toss. And this is gonna give us that drainage, okay? So I like to do this ever so often when my soil get compacted. I like to add a little bit of perlite, even in my raised beds, to make sure that I get that drainage and not my soil won't be so compacted as time goes on. Okay? Which you can tell the soil in here is nice and rich. It's really dark. But I'm going to go ahead and add in some blood meal. Now blood meal is just perfect, you guys, for our brassicas. Um, or our leafy greens because it is just nitrogen. So I will be adding in this right here. This is a Job's Organic uh, Blood Meal. This is all nitrogen. This is a 12%. So what I'm gonna do is just add a little bit into, into in this window box. not gonna add too much that's good and then I'm going to add the Job's organic okay vegetable and tomato y'all guys if you follow me long enough you know this is my favorite okay and I just like using it I'm been using this for so long that it just works for me so but anything that works for you but if you find something that works for you keep using it you know don't change anything if it works for you but this works for me so I like the Job's organic brand and I'm gonna to toss in a handful. That should be good. I don't want too much because the soil is pretty rich, but I have planted um, spinach in here before and it used up a lot of the nutrients in the soil. So I'm just giving the soil a nice, um, a little amending, okay? All right, so I'm gonna spread that out. All right. So here, I'm gonna be planting up the spinach seeds here. Now this is on my seed shop. If you guys are interested in purchasing seeds from me, I do have a website. It's called dubytea.com. I will leave it in the description box, purchasing any of my seeds. Now all of my seeds, you guys will not have packaging until I get around to doing all of them. I did let you guys know in the description that those won't have packaging, but they will be coming in a nice little plastic envelope with what kind of seeds that are in there okay but here is the spinach seeds and what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna do a trough about one fourth to a half an inch deep and then I'm just going to sprinkle in my spinach seeds in this trough Try to make sure you spread them out okay if you can now you can pop them in one at a time but i want to just have a little thick bed of them in this window box so i went ahead and sprinkled them in then just cover your seeds and i'm going to do that again with this window box over here going to loosen up the soil i just love spinach All 
I have so much to plant in the back garden. I have maybe like six pots, you guys, back there that use something in them. And I'm just going to get those started as well. And the other plants that's in the back, they have really started to take off the ones that I have planted already. I didn't get that much here. Okay, there we go. All right, that was our blood meal. That is nitrogen. And this is the Job's Organic Vegetable and Tomato. This is a 253 NP and K. We're going to give that some nice little toss. I can't wait till I finish the greenhouse, you guys. I've been so busy. I really need to get to it. The weather has already started to change so fast. And I'm just like, wow, I haven't got it done yet. I'm trying, you guys. I'm trying. So I am in school. I'm trying to finish up and... Just, just trying to get it all together, you guys. It's super busy. All right, we got that one done. Now, spinach seeds can take a long time, you guys. It kind of want to show its head, okay? So be patient. Okay. My trough, about one fourth to a half an inch deep. Okay. I did my seeds. My seeds. I'm just gonna sprinkle some in my hand. I'm putting roughly about that many in there. Not too many. Because it's not really a big window box, okay? fertilizing this until they start to come up and get their true leaves okay now the perlite that I'm using is this brand right here now I did order mine from Home Depot this big bag and the Job's Organic I found at Walmart now you can find uh, these two products as well at Tractor Supply I can't wait till I can get around to getting all of them done. I'm so excited to try to get them all done. So I've been working really hard to get more of the packaging done. Now I do the envelopes and everything by hand. So it takes me a little bit longer to get things done and processed. So uh, bear with me, you guys. I appreciate you guys ordering from me. I appreciate you guys' support. And I appreciate you guys actually purchasing my hair care line. So I appreciate you guys in so many ways. But anyway, let's go ahead, you guys, and finish up. So I'm right now just gonna water it in with some rain water. All right, that should do. All right, so that should do because um, the soil was already pretty moistened from the rain we had recently. So that should be enough to get those babies started. I will keep you guys updated on the progression of our spinach. So I hope you guys are going to go ahead and get your spinach down as well. Like I said, I am in uh, Zone 8A, North Carolina, and uh, I still have some warm weather still here. But at night, we have been dropping you guys in the 40 degrees. So, but I know the day... Um, the days are still hot, so it'll give these seeds some time to germinate. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell so you can be notified when I do upload a video. And like I always tell you guys, remember, there's beauty in everyone's garden. And bye-bye for now.